Sabi ko magpe-Filipino ako eh. Parang nato English na naman ako. Mas madali lang talaga mag-explain yung fan sa English. Namasta! Today I'm going to show you how I do my brows. Because I really get the question a lot. Abi, paano ka ba nagkikilay? Magaling daw ako magkilay. I'm not really sure about that. But today I'm going to show you my process of how I groom my brows and how I fill them in. As you can see right now, I look so weird with all this makeup on but with no brows on. There are two steps in my brows routine. First one would be the grooming part or the trimming part. The second one is the filling in. The first step is something that you don't do every time you put on makeup. Kind of depends on the person on how fast your brows grow. It's something that I usually do every other week but because of school and stuff like that I haven't really been trimming my brows so you're going to see me groom it for like the first time in more than half a year so let's get on to it if you're new to my channel hi my name is Joshua welcome to my official artist YouTube channel thank you for stopping by if you find this video a bit entertaining please don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that bell button the first step is trimming I used to do it every other week Yay! not so much recently I'm about to one yeah I get new so bug na so bug. I don't think it ever went back to being like that original. There. You see them? For this step, gagawin mo kasi, ano, kumbaga, take away the hair. The little strands of hair that you're not going to be able to fill in. Gwana if you feel mo, pagka yung strand of hair, lumagpas dun, kailangan mong tanggalin yun. I'm just gonna discuss first, paano ba? Mag-fill. Pero second step ba yun? So, you're going to imagine that there's a line here. Ah, uh, natutuwa siya mo. Mag-fill ng brows. So, you should know it. Favorite ko noon si Candy Johnson. Ano yung pinakamaganda explanation dito? Na napanood ko. So, I have here um, a paintbrush. I'm using just the tail of it. Ano ba tawag dito? Ito yung tail? <laughs> you demonstrate strands of hair you're supposed to pluck out. Pag nag-fill ka kasi, minsan kasi hindi yan pantay. Hindi. Madalas talaga hindi pantay. Piliin mo na lang yung Pinaka inner. Unless, like, you have a connecting unibrow, you're supposed to pluck stuff here, but I don't, so I leave this area alone. I do this in my mind, just imaginary. The stick is for demonstration purposes. Start with where my brow starts. I imagine a line that goes from the start of my brow to the side of my nose. That's the start of my brow. <laughs> Does that make sense? You're gonna angle it down a little bit more. Till it reaches the arch. I just realized na malipo ka explain ko earlier. What I mean is to find your arch. You're actually gonna find your arch. To find it, you have to look straight ahead, take the line from here, and then through your pupil, you will find your arch right there. Okay. You sa outer na you're just gonna angle it down a little bit further, and then when the line reaches the outer of your eye, your your brow is going to. To end here, as you can see, wala nang bu, wala nang bu dun. Kaya, I'm just gonna fill it in later on. That's how I learned it, and that's how I like it. Let's start trimming. So, what you need is, of course, a mirror. Ah, this little scissors. I have no idea what you call this pair of scissors, but it is a little bit bent, as you can see. I don't know where I got this. Oh, yes, I remember. I got it from my mom's drawers. I don't know. I like this because it's easier to like make that arch. And you're also gonna use a chani. What's chani English? Plucker? Tweezers! And a little bit of water. I do this in the bathroom. You're gonna damp your, your eyebrows. Ooh, see? Too much. Oh, towel. You put water. You're gonna brush it down a bit. When you damp, the hair here. Makita mo yung mga lagpas lagpas. With your imaginary brow guidelines. You're gonna cut. Oh, oh, oh. I've done this for years. Kasi nagpaplak lang ako ngayon. Now we brush up and cut the excess hair. Scissors, kasi. I have my excess hair pa rin dyan kasi syempre may nag-grow dun sa part na dapat wala. Ang hirap mag-explain. What you're gonna do with that is you pluck them out. So ayun, hindi masyadong kita. Kaya sa may filter itong thumb nito ng phone na to. Ayaw ko nga ng filter ng thumb. Okay lang. Dito yung imperfections of my skin. Kita ba? Ewan ko. Lock out ko yung mga excess. Gamit ko ngayon phone lang kasi exams week. It's exams week. Kailangan ko 
simple lang yung setup para madaling i-edit. Don't ever pluck here. Don't ever trim here and here. Ang papangat daw yung gross dito. There. Ito ba? Yun, kita yung gross. Yan. Ayan yung pinaplak. This was actually requested by Ate Sam. Ayan, happy birthday Ate Sam. Kabirthday niya daw si Ate Sam Galbero. Hindi ko lang ba't niya ni-request? Ito sobrang tagal na. Hindi ko naman nagagawa. Hindi ko lang kung ba't niya tinatanong. It's actually, mas conflict pa yung brows niya sa akin. Ito ba? Kasi oh, grabe yung pagkasabot. Yan. Ayan. So, I'm just gonna do my other brow and then do my makeup and then show you the second step which is to fill. So, for the step two which is what you do on a regular basis, the filling in, you will need a brow pencil. Before, I used an expired pot of eye gel. Also have this angled brush so that I could properly even out the, the, the product. I look really weird. I also don't have much contour with me because my contour expired. Just have some blush on and some darker concealer on and my jaw looks weird. It's hard to get makeup these days. I even just bought my foundation on a whim. I wasn't so sure about the shade, or if I would be allergic to it, but I bought it. I don't recommend doing that. <laughs> and it turns out that the shade is okay, but the product itself is not the best thing. <sighs> really hard these days. Don't have any testers, which is fine. I don't want it, even if there are available testers out there, I won't use it. So, makikilay na ako. So weird talaga tingnan. What I'm gonna do right now is to sharpen my brow pencil because it is very not sharpened. Once that is sharp now, I will, will move closer to you guys. I will also grab my mirror. Just looks so weird without brows on. As I've mentioned earlier, you're going to have this imaginary brow. It's hard to show with glasses on. It starts here and you move here. Oh no, my false lashes. And then goes here. There. Okay, so with that in mind, draw the the lower line. I don't know if I'm gonna trust this camera or I have to use a mirror. Just drew that line up to the arch. Draw the upper line. Now that I've reached the arch, I'm gonna drag it down towards the end of where my brow should be. Somewhere around here. Hope I don't mess this up. Going to drag it all the way down. I messed it up. And then I'm gonna connect it here. It's okay if it's not perfect. Now I'm gonna lightly fill it in. Okay, it doesn't have to be perfect for now. But I'm gonna make this a little bit darker than the rest. And then for here, I'm just gonna do some light lines, upward strokes, and I don't have to fill it in. I'm gonna use the angle brush for that. I'm gonna lightly tap this. Kulang kasi din yung book dito. If that's the case, I just add more product. Iniitiman ko yun yung arch ko. Kasi wala ko masyadong book dun. Here. So yeah. There are numerous ways to do your brows. But this is the way that I like to do it. Mukhang mal dito, but it's fine. Mukha lang naman eh. Do the same with the other brow. Sometimes you would want to add brow gel so that the hair that's that are sticking out would just stay in place, stay put. So yeah, ganon makilay si As. That's the Abby Kilay for you. Ganon makilay si Abby. That's Kilay. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you learned something. And if you do, don't forget to share this with your friends as well. To get those eyebrows on fleek, like and subscribe. In case you're wondering why I'm all dressed up when I don't usually dress up, that's because I have a new video on Thursday that I'm really excited about. Another collab, just a hint. From one to a how friends are you? Better watch out for that. It's a cool one.